Hello, welcome back to Anchored Life with Kayla. I wanna show you guys an update on what has been going on in our brand new house because it's only like a couple weeks away from when we are able to move in. So things are really coming together, which is so exciting. It's very echoey in here because we need to add, you know, some furniture and stuff. You know, when I mentioned in my last house building video that I was warned that there was large ants in the house that I'm living in right now, well, they have shown up. So I just really want to get out of there so bad and move into this place. So I am a little impatient trying to be, you know, patient. Let me show you around and just see what has been going on around here lately. and. Like really, only a couple more things need to get done before the building inspector comes and they have to shut off the water in our current house so they can divert it over here. So we'll probably be without water for about a week, which is maybe gonna be a bit of a challenge. Thankfully, my in-laws live across the road, so I hope they know we're gonna be using their shower. To start with, we have this light fixture finally, which is exactly what I was hoping for. So I'm happy with that. And you can see over here that we have cabinets and handles, and we've got the pendant lighting here. We've got a light here for where our dining table will go. Currently our appliances are waiting to be installed there. My parents just renovated their kitchen area, so Thanks mom for giving us your old light fixture. Look, we have lights. Okay, well, as you can see, the second one is not there because some of the lights that I got, they're supposed to look like that, um, but we had to take some of them out. They had cracks in them. Today my husband Bruce is going to exchange them, so hopefully the new ones don't have cracks in them because I just wanna get this together already. We've got the countertops in the uh, laundry room here and the pa walkthrough pantry. The countertop is a little busier looking than I was thinking it was going to be, but it's really hard to tell from a small sample, but it's still good. Back in the kitchen, I'm glad Bruce insisted that we do soft clothes because, ooh, look at that. <laughs> In my bedroom here, I have my light fixture hanging. And those mirrors are for the bathroom. Hey. And now for the part that is probably like the most exciting thing for me is my ensuite bathroom. It's not finished yet, but it is ah, so exciting. They had to move the light fixture over because it wasn't quite working with the cabinets that are gonna be going in there. So anyways, this is our flooring. We've got these specialty knobs that I ordered from Etsy. This is my shower. Ah! I am so excited. Obviously needs the spout and handle and stuff in a door, but I am so in love with this tile. Is it weird if I just film all my videos from now on in the shower? Now you guys will know my secret, right? I'm like, oh, what a nice background. She's in the shower again. In my daughter Sophie's bathroom, I ordered these cute little knobs here. For also from Etsy. I think I might turn them around a little bit. Maybe have the gold stripe going up and down. Gotta think about that. And then over in my daughter Sophie's room, we have her cute little light fixture there. Today she's actually 16 months and she doesn't have any words yet, but she does have a sentence. What is that? So she was very excited when she saw her light fixture for the first time. Ooh, what is that? So, you know, it's like, okay, good. I picked a good one for her. Out Sophie's window, you can see that where, well, there's the, there's the porta potty, but there used to be that old granary there that you've seen in other videos and it fell over in the wind. Well, Bruce has been pulling the concrete out from underneath it now and now the rain is just sitting in it, but we'll put uh, grass over that and do some landscaping. That's where we're at right now. So this week we are supposed to be getting our quartz countertops in the kitchen in and what else? I think like plumbing, 
hopefully very, very soon. In the kitchen I saw the sink is, is there in a box, so it's just ready to get installed. And I'm so pumped because our contractor is getting a professional cleaning crew to come in here and just like full on clean the whole place before we move in. So I don't know, is it weird and adulty of me to say I'm just like super excited for someone to clean my house? Also, can we just admire this beautiful railing? So if you're in Southern Manitoba, check out Iron Horse for all your welding needs. He did not sponsor me in this video, but you know, gotta shout out those friends. Hey, it has been a week because I have been uh, working seven shifts in a row. So now let's go take a peek at what's been going on in this house because guys, we are supposed to be moving this week, which I am so excited about. Clearly not the same week as when you're watching this. There's continue to be ants in the other house over there. So it's like, okay, one more week. One more week, it's fine. Super exciting that we have countertops. And look at these countertops. Okay, well the sink isn't done here yet, but it is very nice and smooth. So this one piece here uh, apparently weighs a thousand pounds, this chunk of quartz here. So, wow. It's gonna be without water for a week this week, starting tomorrow while we um, get the water switched over from our current house to this house. I'm currently doing a load of laundry because we're gonna have a week without the washing machine, the dishwasher, for this wall space. I'm not exactly sure how when, how I'm gonna do this, but I want to get some of the pictures that we took for Sophie's first birthday shoot. I wanna get them large and framed and put on the wall there somehow. We don't have a lot of wall space on the main floor, so I wanna make use of this wall without being all cluttered, obviously. And in my shower, which I love, love, love. We've got the handheld too, which, because I find that it's a lot easier to clean the shower when you've got this handheld thing to spray everything down. Start taking hour long showers in here. Just kidding. You've got a toddler. You gotta be snappy. They want you. Oh, hey, we also have a garage door. Forgot to mention that. I will show you from the outside. To end look, a garage door. So, it's exciting. We have a big mess to clean up here. It's been raining, and so it's back to being muddy again, but I don't care. I just don't care. I'm happy. Then in a month or two, this house will be moved away, and somehow they will jackhammer it out of the concrete and take it away on trucks so I don't know how they do that but I guess we'll find out. Sophie what are they doing out there? What are they doing? They're digging a hole for the septic tank? Yeah. Yeah. building some stairs. Okay, so they're digging the new water line here and I had no idea they were gonna be digging up my entire lawn. So, and cutting down those trees that are laying in front of you. So surprise, but lots of people are here today. Gonna get things done. So we've got some front steps now. Looks good. And then we have a disaster zone over here. So these trees had to come down because they were in the way for the hoe. <laughs> now, my yard now looks like this. I come in the house and this is what I see. <gasps> my appliances are in. Well, Except for the dishwasher that's still in our house, even though we don't have water right now. This looks like a real kitchen. Ooh, there's a mirror in the bathroom. Everything is supposed to be done tomorrow so they can start cleaning after that. And then the house inspector will come and give us the okay to come in. So, so exciting. Gotta pack. 
Guys, it is moving day today. Well, moving a week. We're moving in this week, step by step. But look, the kitchen is done. Ah, I've already got the dishwasher going and we've got this adorable little welcome basket from our builders. We went with Castleton. Okay, it's official moving day. You can see we've got stuff everywhere. Sophie's being a big help, right? <laughs> yeah. We've got our baby gates here. And at the top of the stairs too. Conveniently, those got delivered the same day we moved in here. So that was perfect. They were only supposed to come next week. So really good. We've already got a lot of our kitchen stuff in, but this is still looks like a disaster here. And the garage is full of things. Like, what are we supposed to do with all this stuff? Oh, goodness. We have finished moving all our stuff in. So I am now moving little Biscuit. I better put two on, arms on him, otherwise he's going to jump out. We are going to put him in the basement. Seems like a good place for him. We are now home, sweet home. Where do I most of the stuff? And we've got some furniture up in our drapes. All right, Biscuit is settled in down in the basement and I am wiped. I need to go to work tomorrow, so I should probably go to bed soon. But I am just feeling so blessed, hashtag blessed, to be here and having my house finally done and like our builders did a great job. We went with Castleton Construction if you are in the Southern Manitoba area. I will be doing a final walkthrough video eventually once we have really settled in, maybe put some artwork up and stuff um, so you guys can see the finished product. But I think you guys have a pretty good idea of what things are looking like now. And I am just loving it. So yeah, the ladder is still there because Bruce is putting blinds up in the windows. Um, yeah, so I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, please hit like and subscribe to my channel. I release new videos each week, so I will see you soon.